Do you have a bolt stuck in your aluminium swing arm? Or maybe it broke off? Let me show you how to fix it. Hi, I'm Francois from AdventureBikeGroup.com. I'm busy with my 1996 KTM 250EXC bike build and I was busy cleaning, out, uh, cleaning up the swing arm and I found a couple of bolts that just wouldn't come out. Yeah, they were stuck there due to galvanic corrosion and just from getting dirty on the inside so the threads are, are gummed up uh, with mud and, and rust. So initially I just tried to uh, with a screwdriver some of them were hex nuts others were bolts like the chain adjusting bolts and they wouldn't even move. So here are four ways that I've learned how you can remove them or fix them successfully. So number one or the first one you should try is to just heat it up with a blowtorch and uh, spray it with penetrating fluid, let it soak in and then gently move it back and forward. So if it starts to move there is hope. Some of them wouldn't move at all, um, especially the small one that just broke off but the bigger adjusting wall started to move so I just moved them one or two millimeters at a time and then moved it back, wiggled it a bit but sl very slowly. The main thing is to have patience here. Then I heat it up again, sprayed some more penetrating fluid and then tried to move it a little bit more. So one of the adjusting nuts I got out but the second one got halfway out and then it got really stuck and I was scared of breaking it off. So I just left it there. One of the smaller, it's the... Um, I think it's the chain slider uh, fit, the, the nut that holds on the chain slider. That was a small little M5 or M6 little bolt with a X nut and that was completely stripped. So I took um, vice grips and I broke off the head. So how I got that one out, so that's number two, is I used um, a small uh, or a punch and I s punched it right in the center of the bolt. That's super important. And then drilled a small little pilot hole in the middle. I think it was a three millimeter hole or four millimeter hole. And then took the easy out or the extractor. So be careful if you break off the extractor, then you're really stuffed because that's a quite a hard metal that it's made out of. But anyways, I was careful and I managed to get the uh, broken off little bolt out with the extractor. So that was quite a win. The problem was the threads were quite damaged and I didn't have the right size tap or I had an M6 tap but it was too damaged to uh, thread a new hole there. At the end of this video number four I will show you how we managed to fix that. But anyways let's go to back to the chain adjusting bolts. So the one that stopped moving the next step was and this is number three to remove stuck bolt from a swing arm is uh, we weld it on another nut onto the center of it so it's again very important to center it get it straight on there so you can turn it out um, and the reason why I did this was the the head of the bolt actually um, rounded off so that's why I couldn't turn it anymore it's not because it wouldn't turn it's because it rounded off so I took it over to my friend Rory uh, from Custom Motorcycle Works and he helped me weld on uh, another longer bolt there but unfortunately um, the, the nut broke off <laughs> so then we had a big problem but luckily he's an aircraft mechanic he builds bike for a living so he helped me and this is where I learned something new and that's always awesome when you learn of a new tool or a new trick that you've never heard of before and that is number four and this is the magic he luckily had some of those threaded self-tapping threaded inserts um, so basically what you do is you drill the hole big enough for the outer diameter of the small little insert and then you take uh, either a tool to put in the insert or you can make your own from just a normal nut. I think I've got one here. So this is what the threaded insert looks like. I'll show a photo and then this is the tool we made. So it's just a normal bolt with a, a nut on it, a long nut as a sort of a collar and then you just thread in this little insert and you basically tap the hole with this. This is hard, very hard steel and this in aluminium, aluminium is very easy but even mild steel you can thread this in, no need to tap it first and this basically gives you a brand new 
M6 threaded hole and we did that in two places I'll show you on the screen in, in the swing arm so for uh, the chain slider where that fits in and then for the big bolt the chain adjusting nut at the rear we put in one of these threaded inserts so they are as good as new um, and that is really magic uh, I got a couple of extra ones here so I'm pretty sure I'm going to need them at some stage but uh, yeah that's a great trick so uh, if you have any other advice or any other tricks to uh, remove stuck nuts and bolts it's always a pain um, and I've learned to see it as a challenge to just slow down uh, forget about everything else you wanted to do and take your time patience is always the best and not give, uh, give up if you see it as a challenge you'll get it out anyways let me know what you think and pretty soon we're gonna start uh, assembling the bike I'll keep sending out videos on the progress thank you for watching and I'll see you next time